The Lost Stars by Hannah Cumming. The world is a bright, busy place full of noise. The lights are always on. People are always talking and moving. They switch things on and they watch things and they do things night and day. They are so busy that often they forget to stop and look up. But I don't see anything. Exactly. Every night, the stars come out and go to work in the sky. They are beautiful to see and proud to shine in the sky every night. But they are getting fed up. The light and the smog stop people from seeing the stars. The stars have had enough. They are taking a break. In the meantime, the world is getting busier. More and more lights go on. Louder and louder. Brighter and brighter. Until... Suddenly, the power runs out. Everyone is in the dark. I remember years ago, there were bright things in the sky. They could give us light. We can't see them. They've gone. Poof. A few remember the light of the stars. They set off to track them down. They search everywhere. Sometimes they think they have found the stars, but it's not really them. Finally, far away, they come across a beach. Could it be? They have found the lost stars. They beg them to come back, but the stars are not sure. Come back. We'll be good. Please. Finally, the stars agree, but only if people promise not to forget them again. The stars had missed the night sky and all of the people too. Everyone made sure that they would never forget to look up at night again. Excellent job, readers. The end. And as always, please remember to subscribe and smash that like button. Thank you. Want to become a better reader? Please check out our fun activity books. We also have premium composition books available now. For more information, please visit our website at itsreadingtimekids.org or visit our Amazon storefront page. Do you love music? 
It's Reading Time Music is now available, streaming on all platforms. Thank you.